I'm Patricia Bueller, and I practice ophthalmology in Bend, Oregon. And uh, we're opening a new practice called AgeWise MD, which will help people age well and to have a uh, prolonged disease-free lifespan. I did my undergraduate school at uh, the University of Chicago in Illinois, and then I went to Johns Hopkins University for medical school, and I did a master's in public health at the Johns Hopkins School of uh, Hygiene and Public Health. So I've been interested in pre prevention and uh, public health issues since medical school. Ophthalmology treats mostly diseases of aging, including cataracts, macular degeneration, and all of those diseases actually have lots of evidence-based medicine to show that um, changes in diet, nutrition, supplements, and exercise really make a big difference in those diseases. And a lot of the studies that have been done that have demonstrated the benefits of omega-3s uh, as well as uh, multivitamins have been done in macular degeneration, which is a disease of degeneration that's associated with aging in the eye. And so uh, one of the reasons I got interested in this age management medicine and uh, regenerative medicine is because I saw that I was seeing patients at the end stage of this process and if they had made changes to their diet and nutrition uh, and taken some supplements earlier, a lot of these diseases and disabilities could have been prevented. We know that aging is something that occurs because of changes in, in your physiology and your hormones. And getting hormones back in balance along with the diet and the nutrition and stress reduction, they actually are all working at the DNA level. These changes are actually changing um, the expression of your DNA and that's what makes them so anti-aging. The things that help uh, eye disease help all kinds of things. The cardiovascular disease, the stroke risk, the um, uh, insulin resistance that occurs, the inflammation, all of those things that are aging, um, they're all present in, in ophthalmology and eye disease. It's very interesting because people, uh, you know, they go along in life and they're having children and they're busy with their careers and, and about age 40 to 45, people start recognizing that there are changes in their body, significant changes. In ophthalmology, of course, the most common one is that they can't read anymore, their arms need to be a little longer, or they need to put, pick up some, you know, 125 cheetah readers. And uh, it's one of the many changes that occurs in your 40s. You know, you also put on some more weight, you can't, uh, you can't build muscle like you used to. Um, all of these changes are because your body is aging. In reality, uh, genetically, and based on what Darwin says, you know, you're supposed to have children and, and, and raise those children, and then, and then you're actually supposed to die. And so that's why all the hormones start going down after about age uh, 30 to 40, and, and all these changes start happening in your body. So I think people do recognize that there are changes that are occurring in their 40s, uh, like the changes in their vision and their ability to read. And uh, hopefully that'll be a signal to them that they need to do something different in order to uh, reduce their uh, risk for all of these diseases of aging. I'd like to not just uh, do anti-aging of the eye, because I think it's, it's really the whole person that needs to be treated for age management and maximize their health status. And it will help their eye, but it will help all the rest of them as well. So um, I'm not limiting what I, what I do with age management just to what it can help in the eye. The whole philosophy behind age management um, and regenerative medicine is to uh, individualize it to the person. I think we're right on the edge, cutting edge of finding out uh, lots of things that can help people live a longer disease-free lifespan. And I think that's something that if I can help people do that, I'll feel uh, it'll be very rewarding. We're at agewisemd.com, and you'll find our email address and our address there.